Okay, now we are going to learn how to create a room in DocuSign, and this is how you should always access DocuSign for creating room. Now there's two different ways to get to the opportunity details, which is the first step. Now I can either click on the, the uh, opportunity name right here, or if I come into the individual contact, I can come over and click on the opportunities tab and click on the view details. And this will take me into the opportunity details. From there, what you will see is that there will be an add or create a transaction tab here under the documents tab. So I'm in details right now. If I need to edit in the details, I can click this little pencil icon that will allow me to do it. However, what we're going to be working is in the documents section here. And what you'll see is that I will have this start a transaction button. If you do not see this, this is probably uh, means that your DocuSign account is not synced right with command. So there's another video to watch in order to do that. But in this case, we're going to click on start a transaction, and then this will take us over into DocuSign. Now, if you haven't signed in for the first time during the day, you will have to sign in. So in this case, I will be signing in. And now what you will see is I will now be in DocuSign Rooms. So this is the first step in completing paperwork through DocuSign. And again, you'll see, keep seeing this pop up here, so just click the X. And in the next video, we'll work on how to add documents and work with the documents inside DocuSign.